Breaking news, don't dump Dogecoin. Extremely bullish. Must watch. Every dog has its date, but a whole year? Indeed, Dogecoin, the meme cryptocurrency linked to an image of a Shiba Inu dog, has been enjoying one of the best years for cryptocurrency in recent memory. After reaching an all-time high in May, it quickly fell in price and has been fluctuating since then. But does this necessarily imply that it's time to dump? Hi, welcome to Crypto Doge News, where we publish the most up-to-date cryptocurrency news every single day. But before we go any further, don't forget to check out our web shop at www.cryptodogeshop.com for some amazing t-shirts featuring Dogecoin. And what's more, we're also giving away a t-shirt to a random subscriber every week. All you have to do is subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Like the video and share it with your friends. Now, let's get right into it. Well, it's no secret that Dogecoin has seen some extreme volatility in recent months. As of August 27th, Dogecoin's trading at a tight range of 26 to 28 cents, after seeing its price decrease about 5.24% over the last 24 hours. In fact, experts predict that Dogecoin investors could soon face another significant fall. But keep in mind, this is not the time to sell in a panic. Cryptocurrency is known for falling and recovering. This has happened to Dogecoin many times before. The volatility of the market makes it almost impossible to predict. It could recover and rise above previous record highs, or it could crash and never come back. Dogecoin is currently in a state of flux, but as it has in the past, it will soon rebound. So here's why. Crypto traders follow trends. Bitcoin exploded and the rush to find the next Bitcoin has resulted in a bubble in other cryptos that have grown insanely valuable. Take Dogecoin for example. If you've been observing Dogecoin's rise via headlines, kicking yourself for not investing when each coin was worth less than a dime, then you probably found it slightly difficult to wrap your head around. You've seen the numbers rise higher and higher despite Dogecoin as a currency not being used for much more than tipping on Reddit. Yes, things have changed now that Dogecoin is accepted as a method of payment by businesses all over the world, but it's still a little insane. While this is the principal insanity of cryptocurrency trading, if a company's stock spikes in price, there's usually a tangible real-world reason for it. Apple launches a new computer, a lot of people buy the computer. Apple stock prices go up 20%, as was the case with the iMac. Cryptocurrency is not like that. Some people in the space believe in the technology and actively try to progress it, but most are simply trying to get rich. Price movement is tied far more to community sentiment, what people think other people will buy than real-world applications. People buy in for the simple reason that they expect more people to follow. With Bitcoin recently hitting new highs not seen since the first half of 2021, more people are flocking to the coin, believing it to be the best investment right now. But let's not forget, Dogecoin 2 isn't far behind. In fact, Chain Analysis, a blockchain data platform, has said that Dogecoin is currently being adopted by new investors at levels not seen since 2017. Chain Analysis chief economist Philip Gradwell says, Exclusive on-chain analysis of Dogecoin shows it's currently being adopted by new investors at a level not seen since the late 2017 bull market, with new investors increasing their share of supply from 9% in July 2020 to 25% in August 2021. Well, indeed, cryptocurrencies are all the rage right now. Everyone wants in and to hodl. Slang in the crypto community for hold on for dear life or hang on your dogecoin, no matter how crazy the price goes. And at the very forefront of the charge into crypto are millennial investors. In the United States alone, two out of three millennials say they believe it's becoming a more attractive asset class. And why not? To many, it looks like quick, easy money, and it's the polar opposite of their parents' definition of finance. They proclaim Dogecoin's value as a new global currency. Musk himself shared a similar sentiment a few weeks ago, speaking on the app Clubhouse. He said, 
Dogecoin was made as a joke to make fun of cryptocurrencies, but fate loves irony. The most ironic outcome would be that Dogecoin becomes the currency of Earth in the future. But Dogecoin is best thought of as a cultural product rather than a financial asset. The reality is few cryptocurrency users hold it as a serious investment or to use in regular transactions. Instead, to own Dogecoin is to participate in a culture. People buy it because it's fun to have, is inherently amusing, and comes with a welcoming and enjoyable community experience. And what's more, there's more time to secure returns. Low effort investing, the novelty value, detaching from traditional financial systems, and the temptation of high rewards. This takes us back to Dogecoin, the most valuable joke of all time. Its rise from 7 to 70 cents was staggeringly swift, and its fall to under 30 cents is seen by many as the beginning of the end. However, don't write off the Doge just yet. Elon Musk has said SpaceX will launch a Doge 1 satellite to the moon, a mission funded exclusively via Dogecoin payments. Dogecoin could very well tank further in the coming weeks, but Doge 1 will lift off in the first quarter of 2022. That's an eternity away in cryptocurrency markets, long enough for a coin to collapse, moon collapse, and moon again. So what are your thoughts on Dogecoin? Have you ever panic sold any of your holdings? Share your thoughts in the comment section below. Also, if you find our video informative, do like it and share it with your friends. Until next time, stay tuned, subscribe to our channel for all new updates coming up.